Ah, uh, yes, books. If my tracking senses are correct, this should be the way to the library. The library. Alright. So there is a purple wall over there. There's also a chest. Cool, I got a heart. I don't know if that just refilled my health or if it actually added an extra heart onto my health. Nope, not getting through here. Cool. The castle basement. So the environment so far a little bit, um, you could say a little claustrophobic. You know, we are not seeing um, these wide open spaces that we might be used to in a title like Spire of the Dragon. But again, those were actually fairly uncommon at this time. Uh, I'm not sure exactly when Kingsley's Adventure was out. I'm assuming sometime uh, 98, 90, 90 some, you know, late 90s. But uh, I'm not going to fault it for not having like beautifully rendered skyboxes. Right. Oh no! Spider! 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 Look behind you, Kingsley! That's a crazy looking spider, too. Look at him. Alright, let's get out of here. Sounds like the s there's a timer ticking down about something. Alright, we need a green apple key to get through there. Uh, crazy spider. Oh no! More crazy spiders! Oh, get out of here, crazy spider! Crazy bouncing fighters, too. Yeah, there's the green key that we need. This dungeon is made of convenient things! And crazy jumping spiders! Alright. More crazy jumping spiders. <laughs> These guys are ridiculous. Eee, and they're everywhere too. Oh man, they're coming after me. Oh. Maybe if I jump up here I can be safe. Oh, there's a switch up there I've got to hit. First line take out these air spiders. At least they're slow. Oh, oh, they come from the ceiling. Oh, this is creepy. I thought this was a kid's game. Alright, let's stand in front of this thing and press whatever button I gotta press. Cool. I just opened up a gate somewhere. Ah, uh, spider, spider! I guess they're not really spiders, though. They only have six legs. Uh, these hobo gimp spiders are after me. Nope. Not that door, apparently. Not that door, either. Let's be this first one. Ah. Ye oldy foxhole! Yeah, let's go ahead and save. Another thing that's fun about using uh, emulators is you get the opportunity to create save states. Um, which, if you are, if you play PC games, you should be familiar with those. You know, you can quick save and quick load in the middle of any given uh, level, so you can kind of make your own checkpoints. Uh, an emulator, but uh, it's always good to keep a backup save as well um, using the emulated hardware, um, the the memory card, just in case something happens to your save states. Oh, and just after I was commenting about how claustrophobic levels felt, we get plopped in a wide open um, sea village. This is rather nifty. Huh. I'm surprised I wasn't expecting this. <laughs>